Okay. Um, let me get yourself a cup of tea. Get yourself uh, anything you need. Uh, let me see if I have enough energy. <laughs> That's so good. Uh, I will slowly explain you. I put on my mic. The sound should be better. And uh, I have just made a Chinese game. It's for super duper uh, pre-beginner. Absolute super duper pre-beginner. <laughs> Of, uh, um, of Chinese, you may get one or couple of it a little bit right. The only thing I didn't write is Ni Hao because it's just, uh, <laughs> it's just uh, so simple. Let me, you prepare yourself. Uh, we will go to Kahu game, okay? You prepare yourself uh, a good device check your internet connection now let me check my anything let's take a break get a cup of tea now we are getting ourselves ready i think yes <clears throat> and uh, i have changed internet hello so good so first let me explain a little bit we will need a couple of people as moderator. Brittany, thank you. If you do not stay the whole time, do not worry. And um, <clears throat> uh, just feel free to stay here or if you need to go, you uh, take your time. How I get it started? I was driving with my son. I took him to school. And on the way, he was chatting. Maybe uh, you should tutor Chinese because he see a lot of students. And in his school, high school, there are a lot of tutor, tutors, old people, people who volunteer to tutor, stay there one hour. Whoever has question, go there to ask. He said, why you not teach or tutor older people? You know, for young children, sometimes they do not have that uh, initiative. But to a certain age, people really want to learn. So I want to start from now. Give it a try. We will do tutoring or we start today with some questions. If any of you, the moderator, you see questions that is more important, you can pin it. You pin it so that I know that I will answer anything related to Chinese language today, to relate it to this. So with all that, get your <coughs> Kahoot ready, game ready, and uh, we will start our game. What is your accent from? Some French or Japanese. My accent is Chinese accent. And uh, I learned French in France. So it was uh, a quite, a, quite a good training. So I maybe add up some of those accents. Okay, now we go to our Kahoot. So this is Chinese for super duper pre-beginner. Hmm. Okay, I am about to show you the game. Ooh, almost there. Not yet ready, okay? You can see it. Get ready. You, you, you are seeing yourself right now. I will make it better for you to see okay we go to Kahoot the rest we will close up so absolute super duper beginner Chinese okay we will play this one 10 questions are you seeing it good later 
I will read the question. The answer.、Mm, I may read or may not. Okay, let's do play. <coughs> Start. <coughs> Let's see our game pin. Ah, it is good. We can have, a, we can have a, the sound very pleasing to ear. It's good. We can have seeing it and playing it. Yes. So, absolute. We do classic mode, loading game, almost there, almost there. So, one, two, two, zero, eight, three. Come on in. It is fun. It is,、uh, um, <laughs> it is a fun and a silly game. <laughs> wow. We have sweet onion. We have a kung pao chicken. <laughs> Eric, Ash, Justin, Merlin. I love Lin.、Uh, Chelsea, Gantan. Gantan, you are French.、Uh, Alex, PB, sweet onion, cherry. Eric, Ash, Justin, Tom, Nook, Mario, Valerie. O chain,、uh, blueberry, Luna, red, Ganta.、Mm, I love Lin. Wish, Merlin. I think I read everyone right. Picasso's. Oh, that's a cool name. Ellie, Alex, PB. <laughs> okay, Lin Gan from. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh no, that's Lin name is a slight. <laughs> Ah,、oh, pancake. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> that's all good. All good. We are safe. We are comfortable here. Okay, okay. We have twenty-four. Shall we shoot for forty people or maybe thirty? Got her to say, "I love Lin." <laughs> Who got her to say I love Lin? <laughs> Game time. Are we ready? Ten questions. I think each question will have twenty、uh, seconds of time.、Um, we will wait. <laughs> uh, we will wait. Um, a couple of more minutes. No, this is pure language, not yet astrology, not yet. We we are not. I just made it. This afternoon. Ten minutes ago, Yaya. Wow, Yaya. This name, I have one student. His name is Yaya. Ah.、Mm. Uh, <laughs> pin my own content editor. Okay, I am the only one who can pin. Okay, I will be the only one who pins. We wait for three more people. You can start to chat. You can start to check your connection, and uh, and uh, uh, write down the game number in the chat. Maybe we can put in the game game number. In the chat,、oh, we have people leaving. <laughs> we can write down the for those who don't know. <laughs> oh wow! Oh, when and why did you move to USA? I moved to USA about thirty years ago. Oh no, yeah, twenty years ago. It's for job. My husband found a job, so we came here. There is this is the place of opportunity, no doubt about it. We are getting started. Okay, ready, set, go. I will read the question. The answer maybe. 
absolute super duper beginner Chinese. So you choose the answer. 我们, 我们, you, mother, we, brother. 我们, 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 我们. Oh, we have, I think, the, the right people are majority. Okay. 我们 means we. Okay. I read it. Oh, Gandan, you are good. 老师, 老师, student, principal, teacher, mother, 老师, 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 teacher, yes, you are good. <laughs> Okay, so this is for, I am planning to do a Chinese tutoring, online tutoring, for anybody who is interested. So, we have fun, okay? 老师, the next one. Oh, every gantan, qu'est-ce que tu fais? Mm. Mm. 学生, 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 student, teacher, principal, mother. 学生, 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 学生. Yes, 学生 is student. Thank you, you are good. The next one. 他是美国人, 他是美国人, I am American, you are French, she is Chinese, he is American. 他是美国人, 他是美国人, he is American, good, 他是美国人. San Bai San Shi San One 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 Two 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 Three 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 Four 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 San Bai San Shi San San Bai San Shi San You can guess it You can guess this one <laughs> Yes <laughs> There are three lines <laughs> 三百三十三, good job. Yichen, Yichen, ten, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Yichen, 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 Yichen. <laughs> That's a grand. Yeah, one thousand. Yi qian is one thousand. Ooh, Pegasus. Mm. Mama. 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 Mom, Dad, Grandma, Grandpa. Mama. That's a hard one. Mama. Mama, Mama. <laughs> I think everyone should get it right. <laughs> Grandma, Grandpa. <laughs> okay. Ooh, Pegasus. <clears throat> 女朋友, 女朋友, boyfriend, girlfriend, Gopan, Gopin. 女朋友, 
，女朋友，女朋友，女朋友。Nineteen go go bin also right. Nineteen, we have majority right. Okay, girlfriend, go bin c'est en français. Pegasus. Gongzuo, gongzuo, go bin is 女朋友 in French. Gongzuo, employer, job, work, employment. 工作，工作，工作。Oui, je parle trois langues. 工作 ，Yes, three of them are correct. 工作 ，It's a job, it's work, it's employment, it's just have something. Yes. 嗯，工作 ，The last one. Ready? Laoban, Laoban, old guy, bad guy, boss, colleague. Laoban, Laoban, Laoban. Laoban. I can forgive you for bad guy. <laughs> oh. Okay. We are done with it. Okay. Podium. Why there is no... <laughs> okay. Did you have fun? Tash me Gorin twenty oh woman. Yeah. <laughs> you can see some of the questions, which one is hard and uh, there is explanation and things. Okay, so let's come back. So this is the idea. And um I want to make this also uh, benefit people, not only fun, if someone really has question and want to get help from uh, for language, this is the time dedicated to language. And uh, I want to, I want to, um, I want to do my best in, 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 in contributing to the society. I speak Chinese. Broken English, maladroit français. Yes, I speak the three. <laughs> okay, I am so happy to see you. Now, let's see. I will go back to our chat and see if there is any question. If you have homework or if you have heard some word that, um, that you do not know, my girlfriend is learning Chinese, but I have no clue oh you must be in europe right she's sleeping um and uh, and uh, <laughs> okay je parle français aussi du parle français amoujiste okay what is your skincare routine skincare routine <laughs> You wash your face and that's it. You speak very well. Thank you very much. Okay, now I come to this and um, I can see your questions and we can start to chat. Even slightly broken English, still very impressive to learn for a native Chinese speaker. Uh, learning Chinese is learning any language is quite uh, quite uh, difficult because our our way of thinking our language structure is very different, and uh, this at least 
we can use this opportunity for us to understand other people. I have trouble with my connection, I think. Now I will refresh this one and see if, uh, yes, I am here. Now it's better. You have Spanish uh, Xiaoma. Do you know Xiaoma? I do not know Xiaoma. What is some advice for someone who wants to learn Chinese? My dad is Cuban Chinese and I was never lucky enough to learn. I feel disconnected from my culture. Uh, to learn a language, first you do not set a goal. Once you set a goal, it becomes very precious, uh, a ve a very, very stressful. Learn something as a way to improve yourself and enjoy the journey, and do not put too much pressure on it. You do not speak French, you do not speak Chinese, you do not speak another language, you can live perfect, a happy life, and that is enough. And take it as an added pleasure so that you can pure enjoy it. It's like doing business. It's like making YouTube video. When your goal is not give yourself pressure, you can totally improve it. And you can totally enjoy it. And language is something that at any level you can enjoy. You can enjoy the pure joy of one word, one sentence. You can enjoy a, a long essay, a long, um, a long poem. But the joy you use your heart to savor it, it is the same level of enjoyment. So do not set a goal and learn it as if you are having fun. And the, at the end of the day, it is such a difficult thing to learn another language. Just to think about ourselves. We all have taken another second language class. Who can speak it, right? Only a small percentage of people who can really maintain it and learn and speak it. So do not put too much pressure. Make it as a something fun and interesting. And learn the core of, of, of a new knowledge, a new set of culture. That is more important than speaking something. It's almost impossible to speak fluently, to make a dialogue. From my teaching, I have seen one person at age of 28 start to talk, start to learn Chinese, and finally reach to a stage that is able to speak. The rest, almost, it's just so hard. Okay. Uh, right now, I am in California. Site address is Kahu. I appreciate all your wisdom. Thank you. Okay. Espresso, espresso. Xiaoma uh, is a Jewish American YouTuber that works in China and does fun video going around New York, speaking all kinds of languages with native speakers. I do not know. Uh, I do not watch a lot of YouTube. Maybe I should. Okay, I will check it out. Hmm. Okay, let's see if we have new questions and things. <laughs> Even slightly broken. <laughs> Too bad. It's four. Yeah, it's four o'clock. Uh huh. Lao Ban. Lao Shi. Oh, one uh, Ashley said, Lao Ban, Lao Shi, all start with Lao. Lao means old. 
And、uh, in Chinese, it's not only means old; it's a way of respect. For example, Yang. My family name is Yang. When I work in China, they call me Xiao Yang. It was I was at the beginning stage. When you get to a certain level, they will call you Lao Yang, Old Yang instead of Little Yang. It's a way to show respect. Sometimes young people listen, hear it, may not be so happy. Why are you call me Lao Yang, Old Yang? It's a very humble way of showing respect. Do I make any sense?、Mm. Let's see.、Uh, thank you so much for the answer. I speak English, French, Spanish, and Portuguese. Portuguese, which all part of my heritage, is the only one missing is Chinese. Yeah, it is. It is. It's just、uh, when you speak Chinese,、uh, when you speak English, you speak French. Latin language. It's in the same language system. Relatively, there are a lot of things similar. You know it, and you go to Asian language. Go to Arabic, Chinese, French, a、uh, Korean. Sorry, totally wrong. If you go to an Oriental language, Thai, Vietnamese, it's a total different language system. The language structure, the word structure, and the way of thinking are all different. So it becomes a much more complicated struggle.、Mm. Wow. Bodaji to the bain has studied six years German in school and. Ich bin Alin. Ich bin. Ich spreche nicht Deutsch. Ich keinen Deutsch. Kennen Sie Deutsch?、Hmm. Uh, it's fine. Yes, you make a lot of them. Thank you.、Uh, all those are Roman languages. I am Chinese, but I cannot speak Mandarin. I can speak other Chinese dialect. Oh, that's great.、Uh, so, <clears throat> and.、Uh, Also, Chinese dialect is so different. Not only Chinese and Cantonese. If a person from Shanghai speak their dialect, I cannot understand. If a person from Hebei, from Henan, they speak their pure dialect, I cannot understand. It's very, very different. Very hard to to understand.、Mm. It's optional hopping, and I would be easy for me as Spanish. But whoa, I was wrong. The spelling are so hard. Yes, uh、mm、huh. -hmm. They are all different.、Mm. Okay, that's so good to see you.、Mm. Let's see if we have anything urgent or anything. How get twenty two? <laughs> Please,、uh, ta is for male or female, and female.、Uh, okay, one friend mentioned ta is for male or female. In Chinese, ta means ta can be for just by the sound. It can be a man, he. It can be she. It can be it. So without. Writing it down, you cannot distinguish. Sometimes, when we say "ta," she is a man, "ta" she is a woman, "ta" a man, "ta" a girl, "ta" a something. We need to readdress this matter. Only by the sound, you cannot distinguish whether it's a she or he. It pronounced the same. The written form is different. <laughs> What the kahu was about? Ha ha ha! So, kahu is a, a game. How good one! <laughs> I finally got one. I could listen to you talk. Oh.
That sounds Korean. Oh, do you speak? Hello, hello. Do you speak Korean? Uh, 감사합니다. 안녕하세요. 바리 바리 송가. Anyone speak Romanian? <laughs> okay. Do you speak Korean? I used to learn uh, Korean. I used to learn Korean. And the only thing still I remember is Bali Bali, Kam Samida, Kam Annyeonghaseyo, something like it. And you can, it's very interesting, even from this, you can hear the root in Chinese. Annyeonghaseyo, Anning, peace. Haseyo is kind of a tail word. Kam Samida, Kam Sam. Is gan xie. thank you, smida, kam samida. So you can still feel the root of some of the 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 the, the, the Asian language, Chinese language root, which is quite interesting. I do not speak Korean, not uh, to the level that uh, that can communicate, but it's the same when it's written. And the Korean language is not the same, but it's the same when it is written. Meaning if you read a person from Shanghai writing, you understand. That is another interesting thing. You know, each when we write in the official language, we can understand. But each of our dialect have special expression. Those special expressions, I cannot understand. And I cannot make a, a particular example. For example, um, Shanghai Hua. I, I, Xiao De La. We all know this because it's used so often, but some of a particular word we do not understand. Even in written, you can understand rough idea, but it, it just cannot touch to the core. Same as if you are English native speaker, you read French, you read Spanish, you can, you can read it, you can understand but it just does not touch, touch the core of your heart, right? Do I make any sense? Why do some languages become extinct and disappear? Oh, that's an interesting question. If it is not spoken that much, it is not so useful, then people not using it then it becomes distinct. Does it make sense? I do not know. We try to preserve it, but uh, but it's a hard job. Mm. Very different. I learned Fem five like by the age of five. Now I can't learn anymore. English, for example. Uh, okay, let me go down. What is like to sing in Chinese? Oh, that's a very, very interesting question. Lily Miss. Okay. Singing in Chinese. Chinese uh, is a tone, tonal language. So sometimes when you sing in Chinese, it becomes so, so, so funny. 你知道我爱你吗? For example, do you know I love you? Ma is a question word. Do you know I love you? But ma, it also means mother. So my son at home, we always make this joke. Do you know I love your mother? Because that sounds come out is the same. 你知道我爱你吗? So it has a lot of this kind of confusion. We use, if someone try to make a joke, if someone try to mischievous interpretate, 
there is a lot of way, there is more opportunity to make this world puns and interesting things. Do I make any sense? And uh, <clears throat> so singing, it's much more, even in, in English, in your own language, you can understand the song, you can understand a language. That is one of the level to see if someone can understand another language. Understanding Chinese songs and uh, and really know the core. It means you truly understand it. And normally people do not get that confusion because we have a common sense to understand it. Only when someone try to mischievously make a joke in it or make something <laughs> fun out of it, do that. Okay. I went to Chinese school as a child, but I never stuck with me. I don't know why. Maybe because it's too difficult. Mm. I know. Ye mi te. Oh, oh, oh. I do not know that. You missed it. Mm. Could you list the game code again? I arrived late and didn't catch it. I do not know if you can still um, get it. I will send you the game. Brittany, I will send you the game. Everyone, you can practice at home this game. Okay, I go to the game. I go to the same game. Let's see if I can assign this game. I can assign this game. Okay. Create. Give me one minute. I am assigned. Oh, copy URL. Okay. Everyone can play this game now. Ready? I put in the URL without. Uh oh, oh, why? Can I send it? Is that too long? Kahoo challenge. Oh, I cannot send it. Oh, yes, I sent three times. You can click on that game. That is, uh, that is the game if you are interested. This game was made for only in only 10 minutes, 20 minutes time. So it's not very well sought. We will make more uh, better games. If I don't know Mandarin, can I still learn Chinese calligraphy and Chinese ink painting? Would I miss any hidden meaning when learning the art? If you do not use Chinese language as, um, as a way of express yourself and learning Chinese art, you do not need to write every word. You can express in only one or two words. For example, let's see. Okay, let's talk about learning Chinese calligraphy. Because learning Chinese calligraphy, there is much more than just the word. First, the way of holding the brush and the serenity of it, the seriousness of it, of it and the persistence. The spirit of Chinese painting is very, very profound. And in case of practice, you first practice the stroke, the basic stroke. Once you understand, you can choose the word. I choose the word at that day, at that moment. Speak to me. This means Qiu Yue, autumn moon. That was last, last year, in an autumn moon. I just practiced these two words. The serenity of autumn moon. 
the beauty of autumn moon. It's a poetry, it's your self-expression. And this one is Chunyu, spring, sun, spring, day. So practice. Once you get to a stage of practice the basic stroke, then choose super duper simple words. Jing, quiet, siren, and uh, peace, like this. So you do not need to learn the language to learn another art form. Learn it for a pure art form. Learn it for your pure expression. And you can understand it and appreciate it in a very profound way, but in your own way. Do I make any sense? I went to Chinese school. Could you list the game code? Yes, I have that game code. Uh -huh. Okay. Thank you. Sound like Korea. <laughs> If you could instantly learn a language you don't speak, what would it be? Is this asking you, Erika? I do not know. I do not think there is any language I can learn instantly. Learning a language is... Uh, this is why there are so many companies can make money, because everyone wants to learn language, but any... But Nobody can reach to a second level. So the beginner level books can always keep on selling, selling. <laughs> it's just very, very difficult. Oh, wow, those are good choices. So different Chinese dialect use different kanji to mean the same noun and word. Um, That is hard to say. Cantonese has their own words that I cannot read. I do not even understand a lot of the words. Cantonese. Shanghai, some words I do not understand. Hmm. Country rules sometimes make it a rule to pick a standard language. As a result, dialects will be used less and less and eventually fade away or distinct. That is quite true. And um, it's also about communication. Just to think about now, everyone use English. And it's for people to communicate. China used to have so many different language, different dialects. Just people from this place to another place cannot communicate. And for the reason of communication, Qin Shi Huang, the first emperor, controlled and did something and reformed language and put some emphasis to a particular language, particular dialect. That's the way to, to, to make a way of communication. Everything is Two, two side, two, 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 two edge sword. You get communication, you lose the other thing. It's beyond my intellectual capacity to know good or bad. If it was a language I know nothing about, it would be Arabic or Greek, maybe. Mm -hmm should be easy for you. I'd love to master my Italian and uh, mm, I can speak. I accept the challenge. I'm half Chinese, but I can, can't speak it that well. I can only understand when spoken to, but any time I try to speak, I feel embarrassed. Do you have any advice? This is very, very common. Um, yes, this is very common. 
why we cannot speak another language. That is, that is the fear. It's like stepping on the board, the stepping on a piece, a piece of wood or board, and the water is running. You cannot find a sound you can step on. You cannot find a sound that you feel comfortable. Your heart, in your heart of a million heart, your heart is hesitating because you do not know the sound. You do not know clearly that sound. This is why it is so difficult to speak another language. Try to speak, not Chinese, another language, French. Um, Guillaume the name Guillaume or some other Olivier, those names. Why it's all can be spelled out, but you just cannot pronounce it because in your system, there is not such a sound. For you, if you have learned it or if you heard it, it's a little bit better. But language, when it is a subject, you cannot learn it well. Only when it's part of your life, you can learn it. My, my sons, when they went to school, they do not speak English at home. We speak French and Chinese with them. That's the only way to keep them. So when they go to school, they do not speak English. It was hard. After a few days, after some time, they can speak because that's their life, right? It's, it's when it is so important, you learn it. Why you do not speak? Even if your family, you, you are half Chinese, maybe your parents did not really force you, did not stick strong to it. It is very hard for young children to keep on that language. Majority of the people do not have that strength. It, it will feel odd in school if you do not speak the language as other people. It takes so much courage to stand out and dare to speak your own language. Right? <laughs> so... Um, any advice for speaking another language? Do some solid pronunciation uh, exercise. Start from the very basic. Make sure you understand the word. How many words you need to understand? You can say woman, you can say wo, you can say chi fan. Some of the basic words, you are in, out, out, in, right side, left side. You can pronounce very, very solidly. There is not a fixed vocabulary list, but at least you get some sound perfectly right in Chinese perfect right in that target language so that you can you can find that stone you can find that base to move on do i make any sense okay let's see we use google 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 sorry i'm so late other country really do well at teaching their children languages I never meet anyone from another country that can't at least speak two languages or more. It's crazy. Um, what is other country? <laughs> yeah. You know, when English is becoming so dominant, it's, a, it's kind of a... Um, so everyone learns English. Chinese movie and try to mimic them. If you can understand but can't speak, you are already half the advantage. Understand a language is much more difficult than speaking a language in truth. Mm. I encourage to learn a second language. 
but often don't retain it. It is true because it's very hard. Ask a French, how many French speak Chinese, right? It's speaking another language. It's, it's just a very difficult thing. It's a very difficult thing. <laughs> I think we are good. It's dinner time. We went to China. <laughs> so would like to learn Japanese. That is the step I need to take. <laughs> what is the step to need to, to, to take to get fluent? <laughs> Ask Japanese. <laughs> okay. It's great to see you here. And... Um, I will make some more games and uh, let's try to try our best to keep this community fun and uh, learning something every now and then. Different game, math game, cultural game, language game. Uh -huh. Thank you very, very much. I wish you a happy, happy, happy evening. Uh, <laughs> I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. Oh, a blushing, oh, <laughs> blushing mushroom. That is so good. <laughs> Have a good evening, okay? Oh, okay. More fun games, more silly games to come. Mm. Hope to see you on Friday. Bye-bye, friends. I love you. One and and the Japanese. Konbanwa. Konbanwa. No, oh no. Ohayo kodaimasu. Ohayo kodaimasu. Arrivederci. Okay. Bye-bye.